day guys welcome back to another week a new day of the week actually today's monday and i just want to start out the day with my like self-care type you know get ready with me type video um just you know showing like what i'm doing in the morning time and stuff like that so if you're new here my name is tara welcome if you're old thanks for returning so this channel is mostly about like my lifestyle pretty much um i do you know different things you know here and there but that's about it i do have other channels for like hair for budget and stuff like that so if you're interested in any of those i'll link all those down below for you and you can check those out when you have time but welcome to my lifestyle i'm channel. about to get into my skincare routine today and just finish getting ready for the day i um uh took a shower already and made some Breakfast, I did things kind of backwards because I was starving. So I woke up to make breakfast first and then now I'm about to get everything else ready for the day. And I so finished vlogging yesterday because I was tired. I forgot that I worked Saturday night and then went over into my, um, um, what? I went into my, um, uh, nanny job on Sunday morning from so nine. I'm like going to try my hardest to vlog every single day but put up every other day so i can you know keep the things going on my channel at you know for the end of this year because you know i want to start going and doing more you know videos on my day to day so so we're doing so yeah let's go ahead and get into this special routine really quick Ooh. Y'all, it stopped working. here oh wait is it working wait it may work hold on let me put the battery in and the top one it was working for a second see it was just turning are you doing that? I don't know, but let's go ahead and change the batteries because it's been about almost six months till I guess I have this thing. I want to buy like any one of these, but every time I go to Walmart, I don't buy one. But I'm gonna pick one up soon. Okay, it's working just that fast. How cool! for a new roller because i don't know if, i don't know if it's uh holding the dirt from all the times i put my face or is it just my face is super dirty this time i don't know y'all but it's twice i did this twice and it was like super super a lot of dirt 
but I'm gonna go ahead and wash off my face with a towel. Then y'all, we have so much to do that we have to do laundry. We have to make some candles today for my cousin. Um, we'll, we're gonna attempt to make the candle that he wants. He wants it with fragrance oil, but I mean, uh, um, um, one with oils, y'all. Essential, essential oils. He wants it then made with that, but those are expensive. And y'all, I do. I still have the candles I made with the uh, with the um, avocado oil and the oil I have. I still have those. They're, they're, I need to make some more actually. I brought some. Um, oh yeah, y'all. Update on those. Um, jars from Amazon that broke whenever I got them my locker called and they just gave me the refund and they told me to keep them so I have I hope I have some jars left in there um I did not buy I mean I did not get any more just got um I just got my money back for them so hopefully I have some to use for the jars. I'm still gonna launch what I plan on launching for my own one. I think her can do that. I'm just procrastinating so badly on it. Then y'all, I did get a new nose ring. Well, I had to get a new one because um, at the Girl Wolf Lodge, I woke up on, on the day we were leaving and my nose ring was completely gone. I don't know what happened to it. I don't know where it came out at. I shook the bed covers. I shook the mattress I was laying on and it's, I don't know what happened to it so luckily I had a spare one which, which every time I go to the um, beauty supply store I always buy extra ones because I just know these rings are you know they're, they're cheap so but I do want to invest in a real one like I had before when I first got my nose ring back in after a while the ring cost like, well, the one I had was $70 and it, it was a real diamond on it, but I lost it when I washed my face and went down the drain. When I washed my face, whenever I rinsed it off, it went down the drain, so I was so mad. But yeah, that's what happened to my real nose ring. So, and I haven't, I mean, I could have bought a new one time and time again, but I just never think about it until I just look, in, look at my nose and just figure, you know. But. This one gave me hell for a couple of days because my whole nose was sore. And it felt like I just got it done, but I really did. But anyways, let's go ahead and finish this facial routine. So I'm using the Seabreeze toner for your face. They're from Walmart. And then in case you didn't see the facial wash I'm still using until it's gone, it's a clean and clear. Usually, y'all, I don't even use stuff like this until it's gone, but I don't want to waste money even though, because usually I, I usually use um, Ambi soaps for my face. Like a long time ago, I used to use that one. I used to use another facial um, wash, which I do. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go back to those because those are for like um, dark skin, like tone like type of washes. It helps even, even, even out your skin. And... As a kid, I used to always well not as a kid as a young as a young woman, I used to use those when I was in high school, and my face was always so soft and so clean. Okay, well, that's done. Oh, I had a lot of dirt on there somewhere. Probably on my chin because it's breaking out slightly. Don't know why, but it's breaking out. <laughs> Y'all, I have the urge to get back to my curls for some reason. If you know, you know. Um, yeah, so. I think about taking these braids out and just wear my little curly puff how I always do because that's I mean, I can do my hair different styles. So I have to just get in a mirror and do it, which I'm going to do eventually. Just takes a lot of time. 
It takes a lot of time to do that. But. Then I'm going to put on the Bio Oil Lotion on my face. In case you're wondering what moisturizer I'm using. Ooh. This um, lotion is a very, very thin. So it's, a, it's watery. But it does leave my face moisturized. It is. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, uh, what'd y'all do for it? For Juneteenth? Happy Father's Day to all the fathers out there. I didn't I vlog about it until you guys happy Father's Day. But happy Father's Day, shout out to my dad for birthing all of his nine kids. <laughs> Shout out to everybody that's a part of the gang. Stewart crew. Even though we don't have all the same last names. <laughs> I think we all have our mom's last names. Because I don't think he married any, any of the parents that he had kids with. Or any, any of the wife, the girls he had kids with. Okay, now I think I'm gonna uh, do some. Um, I'm gonna fix up my eyebrows real quick because they are. They have grown out a lot of that. And y'all, it's time for it to get a free fill on my eyebrows. I'm so excited because I'll be going to Tennessee soon to get them filled. Road trip. Okay, let me go get my tweezers real quick, okay? All right. So I have some new ones. I got them from CVS for like, I think $5. They were on sale. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna show you, turn you guys this way so you guys can, I guess, watch from the mirror, but, cause I'm gonna have to look in the mirror. I can't look at y'all and do this, okay? Oh, yeah, I have a little, little brush here that I can use for the... Okay, so all the ones that I can't get, like, with the really, really short hairs, I just use this thing here. I need a new one. It's kind of rusty, but just get a little soap and a um, little water. And just um, put it on the brow. Even though it got moisturizer on it, but it's okay. It makes it easier to do. I'm just cut it off. It's actually better than plucking, but it doesn't last as long. It'll be probably back like the next couple of days, three days. And then I'll just go over the top there. Try not to get those off up there, but just clean up a little bit. Y'all seen this girl, she actually takes the hair off her face. I will never do that because if it grows back, like your your face is gonna be hairy as heck when you get older. Okay, that's cutting me well. I gotta get that off the get that in right there. Uh oh. Okay. That's better. 
I'll just get it and wipe it off the excess. But yeah, that's how I clean up my eyebrows, y'all. I don't, I don't think I ever showed y'all how I do my eyebrows. I just pop up and see what I'm done, huh? <laughs> well, like I said, I want to record more of like what I do on a on a day to day. So you know, if I forget, I can go back and look at the video and stuff like that. So that's why I'm starting to do more detail in my life type type of videos. see the hairs I'm flipping it on. Y'all see this? I can't wait. Let me get it off there for y'all. See? That's the hairs that were plucking out of my eyebrows. Can you see them? Probably not, but if you can, if you can, they're right there. I got a long one too. There's some more on the side right there, as you can see, but anywho, there, I'm plucking them out. So I got two long ones there. Cool. Mm -hmm. I know y'all I'm weird, I know. Doing there. Okay. Y'all been going for what forty minutes or four, four minutes? I think she's back. Uh oh. Nope. Got a little thing there, but I don't want to take it off. too far off in it because whenever I uh, go, go get a uh, re um, retended I guess the word, I'm not sure what the word is but whenever I go get them filled I guess you can say filled um, then I'm gonna do another detail like I just did but I try to keep my eyebrows like detailed as possible because people be like I love your brows I love your brows okay girl microbladed thank you <laughs> Anyways, let's let's fix our face with this baby hair because we're not gonna we don't do makeup around here guys you do not know if you're new here i don't wear makeup i just wash my face um might do a little mascara i do have mascara eyeliner that's it 
I do my makeup so you will notice that here unless like you know I'm I'm unless someone's doing it for me then you will see it but if it's me doing it by myself I will never maybe do like a little powder so my face kind of matted but I haven't done that in so long so I really won't even tell y'all guys that I do that because I really don't I do it because like one of my aunts uh she she thinks that we should wear like the powder or like the foundation on our face just to give it like a little matte look but i don't think i really need it i mean my, my skin is not all the way clear it's not super super smooth but i love the way like my face you know it, it looks to me you know i like natural i am natural i'm gonna keep it as natural as possible on my face so well that's my whole body too so i, I don't put anything extra chemically on my body if you know if, if i can help it if i can help it so we're going to do some baby hairs for a girl and it's time to take these out even though i just did these braids for my niece's party but y'all the water the water is, is what made my my front came out looking so crazy all of a sudden Cause it was it was cool until I went into the, the uh, slides, y'all. Y'all, those slides were so fun. If you guys know and been to the Dragon Lodge and you guys got on those slides, yeah, y'all, I was nervous. I was nervous as heck. I was scared because y'all know I can't swim. Can't swim at all. But my cousin Zoe, she she will bug you until the bugging dies, honey. So she bugged me until. I said, yeah, like, like a Saturday. And y'all, once I went down them slides, it was so freaking fun. And then even Carrie even got on the slides with us, y'all. It was so fun. I said, I have to go back. Those slides were so fun. And y'all, we had one, y'all, if, um, so it was a red one. If you go down it and then you, and it has a black hole and you just drop. Y'all, I screamed so loud, but it was so fun. Like, the thrill of the day is just amazing. I'm so happy now. I'm I, Like, now in my life, I'm, I'm almost 35, but I'm just living and, you know, facing the fears that I have because, you know, you can't live in fear, you know, because you want to live your life, you know? And y'all, for a long time, like, I was very, you know, like, I was very scared to do a lot of things in my life because, you know, my mama didn't give me the confidence I needed, you know? And then I know, you know, you, and I know the person, you know, you have to like develop your confidence because you don't have it being born. It has to be shown, has to be, you know, given, not, not given to you. It has to be like, it has to be like developed within you. And my confidence has developed, you know what I'm saying? Just becoming into the, into the woman that I am, my own confidence has, has actually started to be, you know, a lot better you know because you know as kids you know our our parents only do what they are taught to do and so whenever we become parents we, we always do different from our parents you know not that our parents you know are bad teachers it's just that you know they do what they're taught and then we as parents will do what we're taught with our kids so yes girls i am and I'm not gonna say fearless, but I'm very more open-minded than what I was before. Cause like when I was in like my teens, I was close-minded. A lot of people told me that I was close-minded. Hey, I didn't, I didn't get it. But now since I'm older, I, I get it totally. I get it. But it's cool. I'm, I'm happy where I'm at now. Like I'm happy. I'm, you know, trying new things.